well, the documentary. I mean, they really introduced me to the incredible woman that she was, filled with compassion and love. And I was a bit shocked that I didn't really know the, the real Tammy, uh, except for the drama and the media, you know, sensationalizing the story. And I thought, you know, it began my journey of getting to know her and um, my journey of trying to get this film made uh, and introduce her to a new generation of people. Uh, you know what, I think it's because I love her so much. I really like love what she stood for. Um, I think in any day and age, um, we need it. This idea that she could take cruelty and transfer it to love. She understood that if someone was being cruel, it was because they had pain inside and they felt uh, unacknowledged and unseen. And so she would always cross the line. I mean, we're living in a time right now where there's a lot of things slinged back and forth, and we're always upping the insults and upping the hurt, and you did this to me, so now I'm gonna do this to you. And she really was the example of turning the other cheek and saying, you know what? I'm gonna give you love because I understand that you have pain and I wanna know where that pain comes from. And it's something I think we can all learn from. <laughs> no, the only thing I knew of her was what like comedy sketch shows taught me, and that wasn't the full picture. I mean, it really wasn't, and I, I, I feel like oftentimes in our history we've done a disservice to women, and it's time we need to reevaluate. We look at Monica Lewinsky and you know Marsha Cross and all these stories that are coming out where we're going, wait a minute, or even like Britney Spears. You know, we're talking about all these stories even now. It's like, how have we commodified? How have we judged? How have we um, made women into um, commodities and? Um, for us to devour and then throw away and not actually look at their talents and their skills and what they actually accomplish in their lives. Why did we focus so much on how much mascara Tammy wore and not actually how she loved people and healed people? So it's about time we change that. I want them to love her like I do. I mean, I want them to maybe just even, you know, preparing for the role, it taught me a lot. And maybe this, I hope this will happen. Social media can be a negative place. And there was one moment where I was getting you know, attacked by someone who was being quite mean to me. And I was like, where is this coming from? And I clicked on the platform and I started to get to know the person. And I really, uh, and I saw some sadness and some difficult things that they were going through in their lives. And I thought, ah, oh, this is where it comes from. So I wondered, I hope that you watch a film like this and you understand that you can reach across and try to heal someone. I hope it, like anyone who feels unloved and unseen uh, and unworthy will see the film and know that um, they are absolutely deserving of God's grace. Of grace. It doesn't even have to be God's grace. It could be whatever you call it, of grace.